I'm Sue Boo bringing crafting to you. Okay, today I'm going to um, use one stamp uh, out of the uh, Little Treats um, set, stamp set, but I'm going to use a lot of the dies. Uh, there's some great dies in this that I use all the time. Okay, so first of all, to save time, I have cut out the little treat box. So all you've got to do is uh, fold and burnish on your score lines. I've cut this out in real red. Okay, so you don't need any glue. You can glue it together, but you don't need any glue because it just pops together by uh, just popping those in the uh, slits like that and again on the other side and then I forgot to burnish those but it doesn't matter they'll stay up like that so that's the first part done you can glue it if you want but it's not necessary I am before I forget going to thread my ribbon through uh, the first part don't need to thread it through the second part yet but I'm going to uh, thread it through the uh, first part. Okay, and just pop that out of the way so that's already in place. Okay, so the first thing uh, that we want is to uh, cut out um, the um, tag label um, or sentiment label from the set. And what you're going to do is you're going to cut... a whole one off so we're going to cut one off you could use your trimmer to do this to make sure it's absolutely straight so we're going to cut one off i'm going to turn it to the other side and i'm going to cut so that we have got three just little loops at the bottom now uh I'm going to make it a bit narrower, so I'm going to do about, about half, well not even halfway, I'm taking another slither off either side, so it just leaves it like this. As I say, you could do this on your trimmer. So it just leaves a slip like that. Slip. Um, piece like that okay so you can move those out of the way we're then going to glue this down now in the uh, center so starting from the bottom going up and in the center okay now that's about make sure that you get it straight okay now we are um going to use this die and there are um is it going to focus yes this one here i want to cut three black um baubles out so i've cut the three black baubles out and what i'm going to do now is the uh, little lump there that's the um bit uh, hang your bauble i'm going to just round off chop it like that so I'm going to do that on all three of the baubles. Okay. And turn it round. Three baubles. Then I'm going to uh, not stick those on yet. I'll leave those for the moment. Just put my glue pin back in. Now, um, you want a strip that is uh, three eighths of an inch by uh, one and seven eighths. So you want some black that is um, one and seven eighths by three eighths. And we're just going to glue that on. So, and we'll put that quite near the bottom like that. Sure, make sure it's straight. Glue that on. Okay, now 
you want to cut out the ring from the set um, you don't need all of the ring but you need the ring from the set and then you're just going to cut off all the ring parts so you're going to make this flat like this so that will make you that shape and we're going to um, use this to be the bottle so I'm going to see whether tip that way Going to put it that way this time right so that's going to be the bottle just make sure you've got it in the center there we go so that is the the bottle now um we're going to um stamp that and cut it out ready so leave that to one side then i've drawn a moustache shape on the back so you need to cut yourself um, the circle here and I'm just going to cut that moustache out so if you start from the actual um, two of the um, scallops that gives you a nice shape for Santa's moustache cut round I'll just make that easier for myself there we go so that now is Santa's moustache so just place that on one side and then we're just going to um, cut out one of the presents do not stamp on it we just want to cut the presents out and then we're just going to uh, round the bottom so turn it upside down so that you've got uh, the scalloped bit at the bottom and then you're just going to round slightly the edges of the tab that sticks out so just round them slightly okay and we want it that way okay and uh, then this part here we're going to place on here move out your you wave your ribbon so you're going to place that about there and uh, then we're going to just cut roughly there we go so I'm going to cut up and round like that. Just pop it again on your thing like that. Uh, to round it a bit. There we go. So that's going to be Santa's uh, collar. So. Uh, just pop out your ribbon make sure your ribbon's going the right way and then we're going to glue well actually I can do it off so now you want to place your um, part of Santa on like that get his moustache and put his moustache on and then you're going to put the hat on now it's we've left it square so I'm just going to round, I forgot to round this, so just round your head. There we go, so Santa's head's like that. And we're going to put it so that the ears are halfway. So you just need to glue the bottom bit. So you're going to put the ears so they're just touching. Okay. The top like that and then we'll put some glue on the back of the moustache and then position your hat so that it comes so our moustache down a bit and your hat comes there so I'm just going to pop a little bit of glue 
on there. There we go, like that. Now we can pop this onto our um, box. So making sure that your ribbon's there, position it. So that you're hiding the box loops. Okay. So you want just that top bit hidden. Okay. Now we can see where we need to place our buttons. So I'm going to put one at the bottom. We've got that at the bottom. Let's rub off. Okay, we've got a glue string. Okay, and off. And then we can pop one at the top. We can have that one going under a bit. And then we're going to top one at the bottom, uh, in the middle, sorry, got one in the middle, oops, didn't let go of my hand, so there we go. And then to fill it with some treats, I've got the little Kit Kat Santas. So I'm going to pop the little Kit Kat Santa and there's just room for two. So I'm going to pop the Kit Kat Santas in there and then thread both of your pieces of ribbon through. I'll tighten it up. And then just tie your bow at the back. Okay. So. Okay, so sort your ribbon out how you want it. And you could actually... Uh, put some sentiment on the back you could put a, a sticker on the back we could have ho 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 merry christmas no. Let's pull that a bit. okay and then just trim off uh, your ribbon So let's, uh, we can put a ho, 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 Merry Christmas on the back, I think. I wasn't going to, but I think we will. So I'll get my uh, stash of uh, parts. And we've got a ho, 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 Merry Christmas. So I'm going to stick a ho, ho, Merry Christmas on the back. Let's have a look. I don't want it showing. I don't really want it showing, so I'm going to put it diagonally across so it doesn't show when you're looking at the front. So you need to get your dimensionals to stick your ho ho on with. So just put some, I've got foam tape that I'm just using up. I'm going to stick. One on one side and one on the other. Okay, and then just pop that off. Okay, and pop him so that the label doesn't show. 
Okay, and you could even hang one of the, the to and fro's before you tie the to and from's from the um, the set as well. You could put that on. Uh, so there we go. I uh, hope you like uh, the Santa made totally out of uh, the dies that you get in the set. Uh, so hope you liked that. They will uh, go in further uh, and not show did have the others not showing uh, but they will poke in the show so hope you enjoyed today's uh, 3d project i will be back with uh, tomorrow with uh, more things thank you very much for watching uh, thank you if you are new to my channel thank you for subscribing all my subscribers really appreciate that you've subscribed to my uh, youtube channel as this will be loaded up on uh, YouTube. Thank you very much. Bye.